Log on to Santander online on, or on your mobile app. I prefer to use my laptop. Select the ID you normally use to log on. Lately, it's been my NIE. Enter the ID number, which if you're using your passport would be the passport number. At this point, I have an NIE, so I'm entering my NIE. It's probably not going to be your DNI, CIF, since those listening to the video are likely to be foreigners in Spain. Enter your clave or passcode. This is the code the bank gave you and it's eight numbers. Navigate to Cuentas y Tarjetas section of the webpage. Click on Transferencias Nacional, which is on the third column from the left at the top. Click on Envio Estandar. Enter the legal name of the business. Enter the account number or IBAN. If you enter the account number, don't worry if Santander changes it to the appropriate IBAN. Check the boxes, Residente en España and Guardarlo como favorito if you want the system to remember the information so you can use it again. If you do that, in the alias box, type the public-facing name of the company or organization or a name that will help you remember to whom you are making the transfer so you can use it next time. Keep Transferencia Ordinaria that's already populated in the drop-down menu. Enter the amount. Write what it is for in the Concepto field if you want. Click Ahora if you want to make the transfer now, or Elegir un día if you want to make the transfer on a certain day, or Envio periódico if you want to make it a reoccurring payment. Press Continue. Scroll down past the summary of your transaction and enter the numbers requested of your electronic signature. This is a 6 to 8 digit number you selected through a process with your bank. Enter the code that was sent to your phone via SMS text. You can take a screenshot and or save as a PDF your proof of the transfer. You can also go to Cuentas and check your account to see if the money was deducted.